Hi, this is Jen from Scan and Cut Jam Sessions. I want to show you all how you can turn any, oh gosh darn it, any um, letter or uh, alphabet that you have already in Canvas into a stencil. We had a member that had a question about this. Because sometimes, you know, when you cut it out, you're not really expecting it, but then bloop, all of a sudden the insides disappear and it's not a good thing. So what you want to do is go ahead and lay out your fonts. Um, and then you're going to go ahead and bring up like this little triangle right here. Alright, and then you're just going to shrink it. Okay, down as small as you can get it. And of course you see sometimes it's hard to kind of do. Just like that. And then you do the little rotating thing. Okay. And then come over here. And we're going to duplicate that. And we'll do it another time because we have four of them. Alright, so let's grab this. We're going to lay it over there and make sure it goes from the outside all the way across to the inside. And of course I got two of them touching. Oh gosh darn it. Got two of them touching here. Alright, we're just going to move this down so we can get, get a hold of these. It would be nice if they would add a layer feature in here on Canvas. That would be so nice for all of us. Okay, so just go ahead and start pulling these little guys down here. Okay, so when you get them all where they need to be, go in and highlight and select everything. Come up to your edit, zoom in past everything, and we're going to do a subtract. Okay, there you go. And then if you want to like cut that out of vinyl or something, you can always go ahead and add in your um, weeding box, which is something like this. Go ahead and drop that box around there get it as close as you want okay just like that and that will so what this does is that attaches um, you know to the outside here so that little piece will then be attached to the outside so it will be remaining so that's how you do stencils Thanks, guys. Have a good day.